Hello everyone, welcome to today's exciting DIY project. In this comprehensive guide, I'm going to walk you through the step-by-step -step process of building your very own mini fridge from scratch. Whether you're a seasoned DIY enthusiast or just getting started, this project is both fun and educational, allowing you to customize the fridge's size, features, and design to fit your specific needs. Why build a mini fridge? Building your mini fridge not only gives you control over its functionalities, but also helps you understand the principles of thermodynamics and practical engineering skills. Plus, it's a rewarding project that you can use practically in your home, office, or workshop. What you'll need. Before we dive into the build, let's gather all the necessary materials and tools. Cooling element, Peltier module, heat sink and fan assembly. Power supply, DC adapter, insulated box or enclosure material, foam board, plywood, etc. LED lights, optional for interior illumination, thermal paste, wires, connectors, and basic tools like screwdrivers, pliers, and a soldering iron. Step-by-step -step guide. 1. Planning and design. Begin by planning your mini fridge's dimensions and capacity. Consider where you'll place it and what items you intend to store. Sketch out a design that includes space for the Peltier module, heat sink, fan, and any additional features like shelves or a door. Attach the Peltier module to the heat sink using thermal paste. Ensure a good thermal connection to maximize cooling efficiency. Mount the fan onto the heat sink to assist in dissipating heat from the Peltier module. This airflow is crucial for maintaining optimal temperature inside the fridge. Now building the enclosure, construct the insulated box or enclosure using your chosen material, e.g. foam board or plywood. Cut out holes for the Peltier module, fan, and any other necessary components. The box should be well insulated to prevent heat transfer and maximize cooling efficiency. ICBA, wiring and electrical connection. Connect the Peltier module, fan, and LED lights, if using, to the power supply. Double check all connections to ensure they are secure and insulated properly to prevent short circuits. Test the electrical setup to ensure everything powers up correctly. Use a multimeter to verify voltage and current levels are within safe limits. 5. Testing and calibration. Power up the mini fridge and monitor its temperature. Use a thermometer to check the internal temperature and adjust settings as necessary to achieve the desired cooling effect. Troubleshoot any issues such as inadequate cooling or excessive noise. Consider adding additional insulation or adjusting fan speed to optimize performance. 6. Adding finishing touches. Once the fridge is functioning correctly, add any finishing touches. This may include installing a door with a latch or handle, decorating the exterior, or adding a temperature gauge for monitoring. 7. Final inspection and use. Conduct a final inspection to ensure all components are secure and functioning correctly. Test the mini fridge with items you intend to store inside to ensure it maintains the desired temperature effectively. Congratulations! You've successfully built your own mini fridge. Now, enjoy using it to keep beverages cool, store snacks, or showcase your DIY engineering skills.